Hello, I'm here for another reaction, and this time I'm about to watch Stranger Things Season 3, Episode 5, The Flayed. Uh, first, though, I just wanted to mention a, uh, I have seen a possible uh, minor spoiler, and I'm not, I'm not sure if it actually is even something that does appear in the show or not, just... And, and it, well, though, even if it is a uh, spoiler, it's clearly not something, uh, like, major plot reveal or something, but I just wanted to mention that. And, uh, also I do have what is definitely a spoiler, uh, for the, uh, the finale, the, uh, episode eight, uh, thanks to, uh, YouTube recommended videos that I keep seeing, the, uh, the titles and thumbnails, but, uh, yeah, I'll, yeah, that is, and that one's definitely a lot more, uh, much more, uh, plot relevant, uh, but yeah, I'll get to that when, uh, I'll, I'll mention more about that when we get to that point. Uh, but anyway, uh, for the current episode, uh, yeah, this is, uh, The Flayed. And, uh, I assume that it means all those, uh, all those hosts, all those people that have been, uh, are, are being used as hosts, they've been, uh, infected and are now, uh, under the control of the, uh, the Mind Flayer, the, the monster creature. And, uh, I guess, I don't know if they're going to now start to actually do something other than, like, infect others, or, I don't know, maybe that really is just the only reason, the only thing that they're trying to do, or, or not, I'm not sure, but I'm assuming that's, yeah, I guess that's what's primarily going to focus on, or at least that's what the uh, title is referring to here. So, yeah, I, okay, I don't have anything else, uh, nothing else to say about the episode before we start, so uh, let's just uh, go ahead and start the episode. Oh, and back in the, uh, that elevator. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> really, you think? Oh, I guess that's the bottom. Oh. Ow, that's, oh, that hurts. Ooh. Wait, it didn't just come to a... it just, like, crashed the bottom? Does not come to a slow stop? Okay. <laughs> yeah. Clearly established that those buttons don't work. They're buttons. They have to do something. Yeah, if we had a key card. What? It's an electronic lock. Same as the loading dock door. If we don't have a key card, it won't operate. Meaning... We're stuck in here. Yeah. Great. Just so you nerds all win, <laughs> I'm supposed to be spending the night at Tina's. Uh, but by the way... always covers for me. But if I'm not home for Uncle Jack's party tomorrow, it's all your fault. <laughs> You're in big trouble. <laughs> if we're dead in a Russian elevator. Good point. <laughs> what if we climbed out? If we survive this, I'll kill you. Yeah, that's a good point there. What were you saying about climbing? <laughs> Yeah, that was going down for quite a while, pretty fast. <laughs> uh, yeah, they're they're pretty far. <laughs> wow, yeah, that's pretty far down there. We're oh, okay. Yeah, that they're checking out that last property. Looks like somebody's home. Hmm. Oh wait, did that say links on that truck? Something pounding. Oh, and electricity problems. Yeah, lights flickering, of course. What's she seeing in the floor? Or looking boat? It's below us. Okay. Oh. oh hidden staircase. All right. Is this? Oh, is this the guy that the guy that? Oh, yep, the guy that uh, attacked uh, Hopper in the lab. Does he know they might be there? Or oh, okay, I'm hearing. They don't speak English. 
Мы ничего плохого не делали, ничего нелегального. Ничего нелегального. Мы механики. Does this guy speak English? I forget, did he talk? I don't remember when, when, if he talked when he attacked Topper. So he tied him up. You understand what I'm saying, big guy? Mm -hmm. Drop the weapon! Or what? Okay, yeah. You don't put that thing away, I'm gonna blow some daylight into that thick skull of yours! No. No? You wouldn't do that. Why's that? Because you're a policeman. There are rules for policemen. Policemen have rules. <laughs> oh. oh, is Joyce gonna shoot him? Come on, Joyce. What was that? Oh, that. Oh, that's not good. Uh, nice try. Still think it was our government? No. Oh, is this Jonathan? Is that Nancy on the phone? She's the one calling. God, shut up! Hello? Oh, calling again. I need you to put me on the phone. Your brother. What? Jonathan, please. Okay. Where is he? Is he safe? Why wouldn't he be safe? Nancy. Yeah, she's suspecting. Okay. Why wouldn't he be safe? Run of a Wait. Man! Where is Will right? Okay, Will. Okay, a magnet? Magnet? Do you know magnet? Magnet? Oh, that's right. They were at the uh, the sauna, the, the pool, fighting off with against uh, the possessed Billy. That's right. They fell. The machines at Hess Farm, where where we kidnapped Joyce, you. Joyce, please! <laughs> you give me a headache, both of you. Oh, hold on, just one minute. Hey. You need to get Robin out here and translate. Progress. Progress. Yeah, thought we knew, but now we know, no, because I've confirmed them. You're welcome. Yeah, <laughs> why don't you confirm whether this baby will start, huh? Uh oh. It's not working. Try it again. Do I just hear some electrical crackling? Something. That's not in park, is hey. it? Hey, подожди, stop, stop, shut up, smear it off. It's about to start moving. Oh, you hear me? I said oh it's smoking. Oh. Shit. Oh Jesus. Oh, it's about to. Oh, okay. Oh wow. Okay, now it's definitely not going to work. Stop. It's not really a friend. It's more like. An acquaintance. Uh -huh. What okay, friend? Well, hey, 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 keep up, keep up, keep up. Easy. Okay, so this acquaintance lives in Illinois, yeah. correct? Yeah. So we're walking to Illinois. Yeah. Oh. We're gonna walk to Illinois. Wait, how far is I? I figure we'll get there by like Friday evening. I hope that works for the schedule. Jesus what? Christ, we're not walking to Illinois, okay? <laughs> I don't know. Okay. I'm, I I'm, I wasn't even sure if that was really a possibility. I don't I don't know the the geography of this area. You know what? I'm all ears. Like where is Hawkins in relation to Illinois? I don't know. Oh, are we? Uh, is this L's viewing? What's? Oh, okay, yeah. I found him. They're going to Illinois. My breakfast. Not now, Mom. Illinois. Uh oh. Illinois, they like they the didn't they didn't hear the whole the thing. Illinois. Illinois. Does it still hurt? Oh, yeah. I talk. It's up to us. Up to us to do what exactly? 
find Billy and stop him. Okay, yeah, that's a really nice sentiment. Uh -huh. Even if Elf could find him again, easier that's said than done. If, then what? We burn the shit out of him and make sure he doesn't escape this time. Okay, then what? Then we win. No, see, that's the problem. We don't. We don't win. That doesn't get rid before, of it permanently. Right yeah. We don't just have to stop Billy. We have to stop the mind flare. The, 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 the host, the original. Maybe Elle does. Girls just like hanging out in bathrooms. Why? I, mean, I don't know. <laughs> Inspiring against me. That's what you're concerned about right now. It's not my main concern. It's just a sub concern. I thought it was already over. It's not over, okay? Uh. Just give me a break. She said she dumped your ass. That doesn't sound like a break. It wasn't. You guys do realize we can still hear everything you're saying. Right? <laughs> <laughs> Might want to talk a little quieter. I told you. They're conspiring. What? Oh, there they are. All right. Yeah, that's not gonna. Uh, <laughs> Did she say that the Red Army? We're still exactly nowhere, which is, hmm. you know, probably just a little bit of the reason why I'm feeling just a tad cranky. <laughs> what are you doing? What does it look like I'm doing? I'm taking a leak. Look away. <laughs> look away. Yeah, they're not exactly with. <laughs> you have a bathroom around here. <laughs> Trying to open, yeah. You don't know what's inside you there. Know what that is. Yeah. Exactly. It could be useful. Useful? How? But this is not water. No, but it's the liquid, and if it comes down to me drinking that shit or dying of thirst, <laughs> I decisions, decisions. <laughs> well, there are some things that can be pretty bad to drink. <laughs> We've got company. What's she? Oh, oh. Someone trying to load some stuff onto that elevator? Are they all on top of it? Did you hear? nothing new around here. <laughs> yeah, they're all on top. Yeah, we'll all stay quiet. Uh... Oh, okay. Well, I guess that container is pretty strong. What is that exactly? Jesus Christ. Some sort. Oh, yeah, burning through the floor. Yeah, sure you want to drink that now? <laughs> A lot of walking. <laughs> Roast beef. Oh, yeah, his shirt. Let's go, come on. Yeah, start moving. Why me? What time was your sauna test? Around nine. Around nine. Well, that proves it. That proves my theory. They're connected. Blade, just like Billy. Played. She was screaming. Yeah, so that's at least three that they know of now. What's a good scream? Max said, doesn't matter. I'm sorry, I'm lost. Who is Heather? She's a lifeguard at the pool. Heather Holloway? Tom. What? Oh, there he is. Let's see, he's seeing footprints. I just want to remind you of something, Joyce. I am not a mechanic. Yeah, clearly. It's where you should listen to Alexi. <laughs> oh, right, yeah. Your new boyfriend, right? Yes, every man I talk to from now on has to be my boyfriend. Uh -huh. This kid reminds me a little bit of a Russian Scott Clark. Oh, here we go. Maybe you should go on a date. I don't know. I'm thinking like Enzo. Oh, uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, uh, uh. He's uh, running. Uh, <laughs> 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 might, might want to pay attention. Son of a bitch! <laughs> <laughs> wow, nice. Wait, was he laughing? What? Oh, he's seeing something. Civilization. Oh, yeah, that's not uh, weird or suspicious at all. <laughs> the guy just walking in in handcuffs. Or er, does no one notice? You all gonna pay for those? <laughs> I was about to say. <laughs> I'm the chief of police, so I can do what I want. <laughs> oh, hey, K. 
Uh, are they about to just swipe a car? I need to commandeer your vehicle. As long as there's a. What is your name? Who is she talking to? Todd. Murdered many children. <laughs> what? Yeah, the true psychopath. I tracked him over two state lines. What's going on? Ah, Detective Byers. Uh, Detective Byers. <laughs> this is Todd. He's agreed to lend us his vehicle to transport our dangerous criminal. Oh. <laughs> very dangerous uh, at forger. Yeah. Oh yeah. Well, or uh, whatever. Yeah. You know, whatever he he did. Yeah. You just call the station. What station. Ooh, I like the, sound of the police station. But... <laughs> Wait, what? Todd didn't see the rest of that license plate. What was it H? H F T R. Very seriously doubt if something is boring as poison. It's gotta be much more valuable, like Prometheum or something. What the hell is Prometheum? <laughs> it's what Victor Stone's dad used to make cyborgs, bionic, and cybernetic components. You're all so nerdy, it makes me physically <laughs> ill. No, no, no. <laughs> Don't let me in with them, I'm not a nerd. <laughs> Why is it sensitive, Harrington? Afraid of losing cool points to a ten year old child? No, I'm just saying <laughs> shit about Prometheus. Prometheus. Prometheus is a great mythological figure, but whatever. All mm -hmm. I'm saying is yeah. walking towards a nuclear weapon. That's great. <laughs> yeah, that's fun. If they're building something, why here? Maybe that's it. Maybe it's our What? Do you think the Russians know? About the... They could. The upside down? Maybe. How? I don't know. That's a good question, but... Possible. I'm sorry, is there something that you would like to share with the class? Yeah, Doc uh, Owens did mention a possibility last season. Uh-oh. <laughs> Picking up something. Uh, they're repeating the code? Wherever that broadcast is coming from. It's close. And if okay. It can reach the surface. Let's go. So we're gonna find wherever that's being transmitted from and... And who is, where is this now? Oh, is this Heather's house? Oh, uh, yeah, of course, the you know, red door. Oh, Jesus, it's freezing. Of course it is. Do you no, guys smell that? No one's home at the moment. Is this left just like it was the last time we saw it? What? What's going on in here? Yeah, I think they're not home. Yeah, they're all at these steelworks right now, but uh you must have tied them. They must have taken them somewhere. Hmm. Mrs. Driscoll. She kept saying I have to go back. I have to go back. Pointing at the steelworks building. If she wants to go back so badly, why don't we let her? And follow her. No offense, but I already went over all this with the cops. I'm not a cop. Yeah, no shit, crew chef. <laughs> Ooh. Oh, oh shit. yeah, no. Look at the camera. The camera. Oh, the conspiracy theorist guy again. Identify yourself. Jim Hopper, <laughs> Joyce Byers, Smirnoff. Alexi. Alexi. Why does it keep saying Smirnoff? Hopper. It's all right. Don't worry. <laughs> A little bit eccentric, but completely harmless. <laughs> oh yeah, that's harmless. <laughs> Name. Yatomoja Delisi. Okay, oh, why am I not surprised he speaks <laughs> Russian? <laughs> <laughs> Hi, Jim. Hello. I should have guessed it was this guy. Is that some kind of is that a metal detector or what? Glass houses, stress. What? Oh. Oh. Excuse me. What? Do me a favor and move your lover's quarrel elsewhere. Okay. Oh, oh. <laughs> this not a lover's quarrel, pal. Spare me. Don't try to lie. Don't try to make. Your problem. Please. Stop <sighs> talking. No. Doesn't matter because unfortunately. We're here. So if you don't mind, <laughs> put that thing away. Stop behaving like a jackass and ask him what he's doing that's making my magnets fall off my damn fridge. <laughs> wow. <laughs> <Please>. <laughs> oh, that 
Oh, it's awesome. <laughs> Oh yeah, just a bunch of people with guns. Oh, that's not a problem. Red Dawn. Red Dawn. First floor northwest. So what? The comms room. And I saw a bunch of lights and machines and shit in there. That could be a hundred different things. <laughs> She's <I'll> observant. <laughs> All right. We're gonna move fast. We're gonna stay low. Okay. Okay. Mm. Oh, oh, hello. Hi. Uh... <laughs> oh, she's pretending like she's part of their... Oh, oh, never mind that. Okay. Oh. Oh, nice move. Finally! <laughs> nice. Oh, well, we can hang out for a little bit, relax, have a picnic maybe. Have a picnic? We <laughs> came here for the radio. Well, this plan is way better. If I knew Steve could knock out a Russian, that would have been our What's she looking at? Oh, is she saying where the mach that machine is? Whatever the flickering. Yeah, they got something. Oh, yeah, got him. Oh, there it is. Oh. We're keeping open uh, another hole, another portal to the upside down. Not me. That is on. She won't find out. T, you're the only one who's going to take. Whoa, 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 excuse oh. me. Where do you think you're going? Visiting hours. Oh, um. Yeah. I was just going to visit my grandma again. And, and this. This is my family. <laughs> really? Extended. You know. Come on, talk everything out. Yesterday. I didn't mean them. I know. I don't think you like those assholes. At all. Have you? are just upset. He was just angry. Wrong. <laughs> don't let that go to your head. I won't. I just look forward to you never doubting me again. <laughs> yes. Oh, I hate when that happens. Come on, you piece of shit. <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah, we're well, gonna try to tilt the machine next. Oh. Oh yeah. <laughs> That'll help. Oh, uh, okay, yeah. Yes. <laughs> Whatever. <laughs> Her. Mm. All right. Uh oh. Is she already gone. Yep. Where is she? I don't know. Are you sure this is the right room? Yeah. Uh oh. Lights. She's gone home. Who's this? We were hoping it might come back. Oh, is this Tom? Whose blood is that? Oh, one of the former boss at the newspaper. Or a co-worker at the newspaper. Yeah! <laughs> <laughs> that was good. That was good. Yay! Yeah! <laughs> Get away. Does your species like M&Ms? <laughs> I like the new look, by the way. It's cool. Thanks. Okay. Who else are they gonna run into? No, I don't want her in my damn house. Come on, pick up! <laughs> uh oh. Oh no. Oh. Oh, what is he? Oh, no. Oh. Come on, Nancy. 
Oh, what is that? Scissors or? Oh. Or something sharp. Oh. Oh, what? Who is this now? Oh. Where are you going? What? They just kill everyone in the hospital? Uh oh. There he is again. Oh man, Jonathan. <laughs> Yeah, I think this guy wouldn't mind if Nancy just flat out kills him. I don't care if he's possessed. <laughs> Nancy. Oh. Oh no. Oh. Oh. Oh, that stunned them all at once. What are we going to do now, though? They don't have anyone to lead them to where... Uh-oh. He knows what's up. Oh, uh, they're escaping from his, from his body. Oh! Oh, he just, like, he just melt? Into that goo? Ugh. And, oh, I guess I can just follow this puddle of goo now. That'll do it. Or it'll just turn into some monster which will try to kill them again. Oh, what is. Okay, uh, so here we, uh, first thing we saw here was, uh, was, uh, uh, Steve, Dustin, Robin, and Erica at their, uh, in the, uh, at the bottom of that elevator, uh, below the mall, they found out that there's something else down there, that there's this whole, uh, I guess, like, the, well, the tunnel and the, all this, uh, other stuff, other, some, something going on, else, all this other, uh, uh, infrastructure and stuff down there that uh, yeah they find the what is apparently the source of that that code that they've been uh, that they've uh, been previously decoding and yes they uh, just uh, yeah they try to get to the comms room but then they find something else this uh, they see something yeah which turns out to be uh, that is the machine that is where that uh, the uh, the second version of that machine is it's some I don't really I, I don't know how far down how many stories down uh, somewhere below the mall it's uh oh, and well okay I'm not I'm not sure how much they were able to tell from their vantage point that, that not not sure how much of like the machine or whatever they they were able to see from where they were looking, but well, obviously you know we the audience see that yeah you know, there is the machine down there apparently, keeping open a, a a portal over to the upside down it looks like, and and that's uh, and that go and apparently that's uh, probably connected to uh, to what uh, Joyce and Hopper were looking at, which was all that that. Uh, those different properties, which we saw in this case, was the last one they went to, the Hess, uh, Hess property, which I think that's, uh, they said that, that that seems to be, that's near the power station, so I guess they were hooking up, uh, they had, so that, yeah, they did have uh, something going on there, they had guys working down there, I assume that that's where they, like, hooked into the power station and used that to connect to, uh, to help power their machine, and so they, uh, found... They uh yeah got uh, found these couple of Russian guys and this other one uh, the other guy who had uh, attacked Hopper he he went back there and tried to uh, tried to attack him again and uh, they managed to get away except yeah and then the whole thing with the uh, the yeah their uh, car their, or the truck gets yeah hit by a bullet and then they have to fix it and it blows up in smoke and yeah so they have to. <laughs> 
to just swipe someone else's car with this whole excuse about uh, transporting some dangerous criminal. <laughs> Which, but, uh, well, basically, yeah, they, uh, they, they, they just find out that, yeah, there definitely is something at that property at the Hess, Hess property, but, yeah, they're still being chased down by that, uh, that one Russian thug and, uh, but yeah, and then, then they went to, uh, the, back, back to the conspiracy theorist guy, uh, Murray. So, uh, yeah, uh, yeah, of course, Hopper knows him, uh, I'm not sure, uh, the, you know, Hopper describes him as, yeah, uh, it, friend, acquaintance, uh, sort of, I'm not sure how Hopper knew where that guy, know where that guy lived, but I guess he was, yeah, as I noted last season, apparently he's a kind of a, a he seems to be, a a uh, frequent visitor to the police department with uh, given all sorts of conspiracy theories and stuff. So I guess they knew him pretty well. And yeah, so they, and apparently, yeah, he speaks Russian. So I guess he's going to find there. He can at least try to find out something from this, uh, the Russian guy. I think it was Alexei or Smirnov. <laughs> Hopper keeps calling him because <laughs> I, I don't know why, but, but, uh, I don't know. Is that like a stereotypical Russian name or something? I'm not sure. Uh, <laughs> but yeah, they're, so yeah, Hopper enjoys trying to get answers from this guy through, uh, yeah, with, uh, with Murray as a translator. Uh, yeah, so we, yeah, haven't seen where that, where that's gone yet. We just ended with, uh, <laughs> with this great, the night great scene of Joyce just, Telling uh, Murray about all the stuff that all the crap that she's gone through, not to, not to, uh, <laughs> to just you know, cut the crap. Just uh, you know, don't bother. You just just start questioning the guy already. <laughs> just start asking him questions. Find out what he knows. And uh, <laughs> and I guess we'll soon find out what happens with that. Whatever answers he, whatever I don't know if he's. I'm not sure how willing he is to give information. I don't know. Maybe he's like a low-level, uh, like bottom-level employee. Maybe he. I'm not sure how much he knows, or maybe he doesn't really care about the, or too much. Maybe he's just being paid and doesn't really. I don't know. I I don't know. I haven't really seen enough of him yet, or really get an idea of what he uh, what he's like. Uh, but uh, I guess we'll find out soon what becomes of uh, Murray's questioning of him. And uh, and what else? Uh, oh, yeah, and then yeah, Nancy and Jonathan. When they, uh, yeah, they finally join back up with the rest of the group, the rest of the, uh, the kids. Uh, Will, Mike, and uh, Lucas, and then Alan, Max, all of them now working together. And all, and all, all of them decide ultimately to go to the hospital, back to the... Uh, Doris Driscoll, where she was, and uh, try to let her out to let her uh, lead them to wherever, to wherever uh, all the uh, all this stuff is happening, wherever that she was trying to get back to. But yeah, she's gone, and it turns out uh, apparently they were expected. Uh, so we saw the uh, yeah the uh, Tom, the uh, their former boss, the news yeah. Uh, Jonathan and Nancy's former boss, the newspaper, and uh, I forget his name, the other guy at the newspaper who was always making fun of Nancy or whatever. But anyway, the, they were both dope in, uh, they, yeah, they were both, of course, yeah, flayed. They were waiting for her and for them. And uh, yeah, uh, yeah, so nothing, I don't know what happened with uh, Mrs. Driscoll. I guess she, they, I guess they already let her go and she's already gone to wherever the rest of them are. Uh, probably, but, uh, yeah, what that ended up with was, uh, then, uh, Nancy and Jonathan just ended up killing those two from the newspaper, or, or at least, and, uh, they all, uh, melted or whatever, and all joined together into some, now, into some other monster now, uh, so I don't, not sure if that's gonna just, if it's going to just go... If it's just gonna go back to that uh, steelworks building, or I don't know, considering what we saw last of it with the uh, uh, <laughs> opening its mouth to roar at them, maybe it's about ready to attack them. 
<laughs> that seems to be the most likely possibility. Not just go back immediately, but you know, probably try to kill them again. And but uh, hopefully they can get away. They got uh, if they can get down, just get downstairs where they have the rest of the their kids, especially with Elle, of course. I'm sure she could be of a lot of help here. If they can get back downstairs, away from the monster. But, uh, yeah, anyway, uh, I think that was everything, though. That was, uh, yeah, that, I think, that yeah, pretty much accounts for everyone, doesn't it? Uh, yeah, the, uh, yeah, Will, Will, Mike, uh, Lucas, L, Max, <laughs> Nancy, Jonathan, yeah, all of them in one group, and then Joyce and Hopper, and then, uh, yeah, Dustin, Steve, Robin, and, uh, Erica. I think that, yeah, that should account for everyone, uh, and, uh, hmm. And, yeah, I did like seeing more of, uh, <laughs> just the, all, again, the interactions with the Dustin and Steve, <laughs> but, uh, and... Well, actually, it wasn't really much, but yeah, just uh, <laughs> Steve asking them, "Oh, are you uh, <laughs> are you in shape?" Yeah, I was looking at you, roast beef. Oh, yeah, I think it was only this episode when I first noticed what <laughs> that shirt uh, Dustin was wearing. That apparently that it says roast beef. I, I don't not really sure what that's supposed to mean. If that's a reference to something, I, I don't know. Uh, uh, but. Uh, Uh, well, oh yeah, we did see the J Jonathan, Nancy, finally maybe uh, like working things out a little bit, talking it, talking it over, and <laughs> yeah, uh, Jonathan acknowledging that Nancy, uh, Nancy was right to do what she did, and and then uh, uh, Will or I'm uh, sorry, Mike, uh, Mike maybe starting to try and talk things up with Al, though we haven't, so we didn't see much of that. Uh, I guess they'll continue trying to talk things over, and well, next next episode maybe, uh, or maybe they'll get interrupted when Jonathan and Nancy come down running away from the monster. I <laughs> I don't know, but uh, but at least they're I guess trying a little bit to uh, patch things up a bit. Uh, uh, but anyway, uh, okay, yeah. Can't think of anything else to say. Uh, um, yeah, I guess. Uh, yeah, I guess we'll find out if. Uh, yeah, I guess the. Uh, yeah, like I said, down the Hess farm, that uh, whatever is happening down in that basement must be connected to the power station and then powering up that machine. So that must be connected to there somehow. And uh, I don't know that. Uh, Hopper and Joyce, yeah, the, since they're over, I'm not sure, yeah, Hopper said they were but going to Illinois, I'm not, I don't remember where that guy lived, where Murray lived, was that in Illinois? I don't know, I, I don't know the geography, I didn't bother to look it up, it's not really important, but, uh, I guess it's not too far away, uh, but, uh, I don't know if, uh, Murray's, uh, if that uh, that thug after him, if he's gonna be able to trace them back to Murray's from that uh, car, hmm. The last we saw of him, I think, yeah, he was uh, at trying to, he was getting trying to ask for information from the store clerk, so about about the uh, about the guy that was complaining to the police and about his car was stolen. So I guess I don't know if uh, Murray. How much uh, defenses Murray's home has? Is he gonna be able to keep that guy out if he if that guy does manage to track them there? Hmm. Hopefully it does. Hopefully they. Uh, I don't know. He, yeah, he seems pretty paranoid, so he's probably got some pretty tough defenses. And of course, yeah, he, he's clearly yeah got uh, armed too. As we you know see him with the shotgun, and as soon as he sees someone he doesn't know. <laughs> Uh, so hopefully, yeah, that should be enough to, maybe enough to keep him out, hopefully, at least for some time. But anyway, uh, uh, okay, yeah, don't have anything else, so, uh, okay, yeah, just, uh, I'll just uh, see you next episode, uh.
Until then, later. Bye.